It's been revealed that Emirates' fleet of Airbus A380s is worth 10 times its next closest competitor. Oftentimes synonymous with the giant aircraft, Emirates is the largest operator of the type in the world. The Super Jumbo's value has risen significantly this year as more operators return the wide body to active service amid surging demand and insufficient capacity. For instance, the market value for a 12-year-old A380 has risen 14.3% yearly to over $37 million. A recent A380 sale in December 2022 has the aircraft going for £25.3 million pounds, or $32 million, up from its estimated value of $27.48 million. The total number of routes served by the A380 has increased significantly this year relative to 2022. Less than half of the A380 fleets worldwide remain temporarily parked or in long-term storage this summer. Over 200 aircraft switched to inactive in 2020 as international passenger traffic dropped. As the A380's largest world operator by a significant margin, Emirates relies heavily on the wide body. The airline previously indicated it intends to operate its A380s into the 2030s as they form a substantial part of its Dubai hub operations. Lufthansa has also returned the A380 to service until 2027 at the earliest. On daily flights from Munich to Boston, the airline substitutes the aircraft for its older and smaller Airbus A340-600. The Star Reliance carrier is also selling six of its 14 Airbus A380 aircraft back to Airbus. The value of the aircraft has since dropped due to, quote, storm damage not covered by insurance. Airbus will now only pay 302 million euro or 327 million dollars for the six jumbo jets, with the proceeds likely going towards the 20 Airbus A350 900s on order by the German flag carrier. Qatar Airways is also increasing A380 services this year. The airline will fly its 517-seat A380s to Paris for the rest of the summer. Also from major Gulf carriers, Etihad reactivated its second A380 earlier this year. The type will fly from Abu Dhabi to London Heathrow with triple daily service, up from the previously scheduled double daily. So who is buying up A380s these days? Well, recent transactions are few and far between, but include the launch of a new Airbus A380 airline. UK-based startup carrier Global Airlines purchased the 15-year-old MSN006 from Doric Asset Finance in May. The price is undisclosed, but according to Gary Critchlow, head of commercial analysts at Aviation Values, it is currently worth $28.5 million using standard depreciation metrics. On the other side of the world, Qantas wants to sell the rest of its A380 fleet by 2027. The Australian airline previously scrapped two of the 12 it had in service. Have you had the opportunity to fly on an A380 yet? Share your experiences by leaving a comment. In addition to our daily YouTube videos, Simple Flying publishes over 150 articles every week. If you're looking for the latest aviation news and insights, visit simpleflying.com.